should we clear cache on iPhone? We should empty out all the junk on our iPhone by clearing the cache. Over time, our iPhone will get clogged up with useless files that it picks up from Safari and other apps. All these files end up in our iPhone's cache and ultimately slow it down. That's why we need to clear our iPhone's cache from time to time. How do we clear out the Safari cache? Please do take note that clearing the cache on Safari will log you out of all the websites that you're currently logged into. First step we could do is open the settings app and scroll down to Safari. Then in the Safari settings, scroll down and tap clear history and website data. Third is to tap clear history and data, then this should make browsing on Safari a lot faster and should stop any problems that you're currently facing on web pages when you have cleared the files. How do we clear out useless app data on iPhone? Similar with Safari, our apps also pick up lots of useless data that we don't need. Here's how we get rid of the useless app files stored in our apps. Tap Settings, then General, then go to iPhone Storage. This page will show the apps that take up the most storage at the top. Tap on one of the apps. If the app's documents and data entry shows that the app is taking up more than 500 MB, it is a recommendation that we uninstall and reinstall the app. For this example, we are deleting the Stacks app. This should make browsing on Safari a bit faster and free up the iPhone from unnecessary files picked up by the apps. If you do find the topic helpful, do not hesitate to show us your love. Smash the subscribe button. Click on the bell icon. Have a good one folks.